Ne znam, mali ti si kutila na stavu. Hajde. Ide neki. Look at, look at, look at, bro. My brother. My brother, things are not getting any better. Blend the barbecue. I get it. And granite. Hard labor. Don't do any complaint. Once I finish, when I will rush your house. No try, man. No try. You're not grateful to God. You don't know we should be thanking God. At least once in a while, we'll catch one move and chop. What we talk about is civil servants. Eight months, no pay. Oh, but you know the members say, 800 people are about to be returned. Returns. That's not the only aspect we are like about this job. <laughs> We're independent. See, many of the colors for one night. No problem. The day I go pick. Uh -huh. That reminds me. Is there any person where we speak Latin? You don't want to go away. You better catch now. Only Latin they speak. I need to communicate. I'm not going to really do that. Oh boy, I fear this bread. Because of the consequences. You can handle it. You don't have alimentary canal. <laughs> you can eat it. Better, better eat. You, you have a problem very soon. Better eat. Better. No, let me drink water. Um, bro, uh, you are the one that I created for my own. You can handle this one. <laughs> no problem. I will eat it. But you see, my problem is once you finish eating this, you go to your house because you can't offload here. Oh, oh, you don't have water. <laughs> <laughs> see, when I pick, it will be bugger. Right now, if I see a creep, eh, I'll marry her. <laughs> I don't care. Frank, be very careful. This one that you're anxious and eager. Be very careful. There's always a price tag for everything you do. Oh, price tag? You think I don't want to drive this? Man, look, price tag or no price tag, man. Forget it. I mean, man, I don't care. Um, <laughs> let me see what I can do for you when you come to my office. I have my car here. Now, uh, this is my car. My office address is there and my phone number is there. So always give me a call before you come in case I'm not in town. Okay? Let me see what I can do for you.
And let me tell you guys, do you know that when I stepped into Roland's compound, my brother, I immediately knew this guy have arrived. I'm telling you, man. Frank, all fingers are not equal. <laughs> You see, you don't have to be looking at people. Some people are rich, some people are poor. Why don't you just wait for your own destiny? May children, but forget this thing about destiny. Ah, huh? what are you talking about? You, you have your own destiny. I have my destiny. You can do whatever you like with it. Maybe do why, why are you always listening to this I'm man? listening to you. Eh? Huh? Forget, forget my children, tell me. Forget this person. What happened, my brother? Tell me. Man, this guy gave me one connection, one thing. Uh, tell me. Huh? A girl that owns a big supermarket. A big supermarket. You know New American Quarters? After the courts. Boy, in fact, he even took me there. But unfortunately, we didn't meet the lady. Supermarket? When I thought you wanted to tell me about the governor's daughter or... or, or... No, 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 child, cool down. Your blood is always running hot. Let me give you the real lingo. Do you know that the supermarket is not the attraction? The attraction is the girl's father. Do you know who the girl's father is? This woman is loaded. Very rich. Loaded to the teeth. Guess who? Boy. Mega gold West Africa. Franco, uh, just tell me you are joking. That is, is it the mega gold West Africa that I know? It is the same mega gold West Africa you know. <laughs> no, wait, wait. The man that has just one daughter. There you go. That's the girl. That is the girl I'm talking about. Franco. Franco, let me go now. Franco, was it only just one connection you gave to the whole family? Are we to this? Why don't you go stop daydreaming? Eh? I'll just listen, listen, listen. Maybe this is my lady. People should look for some thoughts. Why can't you just believe in God? God is the author and finisher. He said, I'm going to talk about talk again. Faith! Do you have faith? Okay, no, no, no. Do you know the same God you're talking about? Give me a revelation through a vision that my success will come through this way. Oh, yes. The same with me. Same with you. Oh, yeah. Okay, so two of you now. Fishermas. I don't I don't know. Nah, but for this slack of my head. You don't say you know you know this is like that makes you Oh boy. That is where the game is boy. You have to do something. You have to connect me. Okay, I'll be seeing I'll be watching your baby. So how much is all this? Five thousand five hundred. Oh wait, how much is all this? You don't tell me that nonsense. For the past five minutes or so, I've been standing here and you've been attending to other customers. Have I become so small or what? Oh, don't tell me that rubbish. Now, why are you talking to me like this? Don't be stupid. How can you talk back at my customers? Don't you know that customers are precious? Money me for the last time. Don't ever be rude to my customers. Lousy girl. Manalas girl. Madam, it's a good thing you came out, otherwise you would have lost a good customer like this. My brother, thank you. Eh? Sorry, I've been attended to you. I've seen what's going okay. on. Oh, not actually. Um, you see, I'm, I'm looking for this uh, brand of uh, mobile telephone called... Uh, Check my ghost. Barakola or Tyrola or Motorola. Oh, I, know. Uh, I know of a Motorola, but for Barra, whatever, I don't think so. No, 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 that's a new product. It's a new product. It's just out of the market from Japan. Really? Yeah, Japan. Japan. We don't sell phone accessories here. Would you? Get some money, go and get my food. Enjoy, take over the seat. Are you, 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 next time you get rude to a customer, I will personally slap you. Thank you very much for your concern. You know these teenagers, I don't know. They get unnecessarily rude sometimes. They snap you about it. Uh, yes, madam. One more thing, man. I, I was going through your perfume. There's this perfume I'm looking for. It's called uh, Aquila Perfume by Versace. Aquila perfume by Versace. Yeah. Mm, I don't think I. I no, no, no. It's one of the latest in his collection. I saw it in Paris the last time I traveled abroad. Well, anyhow, beautiful place you have. Mm. Very well stocked. Thank you very much. Just unfortunate so that uh, everything I want is out of stock. Don't worry. The next time you come in, you'll get what you want. Um, okay. 
I'll be on my way, okay? Okay, we'll see some other time. Enjoy. I need water. Not true, say, I be poor man, no. It's very bad. I no get the money. Come on, she, she. No, they my pocket. No, be my fault. That's so I say I'm. But make you not look me with small eyes. Because I no be eating. Bolly, go. I say, guy, man, with African insurance. Anyway, they, I must find them. Me, self, go make money. Me all these questions. Please, please don't be angry. I just want to know. There's something I want to know, please. Eh? Does she live in Jiaru? Yes, she does. One more thing, please. Don't be angry. Uh, about what time does she normally come to work? Um, she comes to work 9 a.m. each day. Thank you. Uh, thank you. It's all you right. Know, but it's okay, it's nothing. So can I just drop you over in your house so that you can at least change? No, 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 no. When I get to the office, you know, I'll change the clothes. Um, which way are you going to? Um, uh, Dotu Drive. Dotu Drive is very close to my shop. Oh, really? May I have the privilege to at least drop you over in your office? I'm all yours, madam. I'm all yours. Please get inside the car. Okay, I see you here. Yeah. No, 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 there, turn, turn, no, 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 come in. No, no, madam, I'll No, 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 I said, come in let and sit. Let me sit in front. I can't I sit with madam. No. Okay, I want you to turn in and sit in. Okay, okay, it's all right. Uh -huh. Man, where the mold ever put for another man mouth? Uh. If the hungry grow, ah. Happy mouth, they bend it to swell ever. Crayfish bend a condition maker, but even self can fish like a fish. You have a wonderful car. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, please don't say I'm being forward. What about your husband? <laughs> 
I'm not married yet. I'm very, very single. Very single. Oh, I see. Well, I am surprised. You're very pretty. Thank you very much. Uh, you see, one thing about me is that uh, I like being direct when I talk. So, um, I don't want friendship. You know, I don't want any kind of friendship. I want to marry you. My God, you're such a funny man. <laughs> Listen, I've had this for me, thousand and one men, right? At the end of the day, nothing. Do you know some have actually gone to the extent of paying my diary? At the end, they misbehave. Madam, I, I am not like that, okay? My motive is very, very genuine. Just give me a trial, okay? Listen to me, I'm not interested. I'm not interested. Why do you think my shop is like that? It's because there are some wolves that come in sheep's clothing. I'm not interested. Uh, Madam, but just give me Excuse me. Peter. Peter! Madam. Stop this car. Get down. I said get down! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Huh? I'm still begging you, Madam. actually make her to see things from your own point. I mean, make her understand your stand. <laughs> eh? That what you wanted was actually marriage. Chaiki, why are you talking like this? Is it today that you know? I told her everything. Everything. Are you sure? But you know what marveled me most? She seemed to know everything I was saying. Before I could say one word, she was already there. Matima, do you know what she told me? She told me she has seen all sorts of gold diggers. Yeah. As if she knew where I was going to. I became scared, very scared, so I didn't know what to do again. Anyway, you know that there are two sides to a coin. Yes. Uh -huh. So if the woman tries to be wise, you should try to wisen up. Wisen up? How else? Am you I have to wisen up and claim her now. Claim her how now? That's what, what I'm saying. I told you, I've done, I've done everything now. Yes. What, what I'm trying to say, since she's refusing to play ball with you, employ African insurance. A.K.A. Equi Equi Native doctor. Are you saying we should go to a native doctor? Are you a saint? Haven't you done it before? <laughs> <laughs> Please. And the sooner the better. Before smarter guys claim her. A lot of people are out there on the street prowling for who to handle. You understand? Check it. I think you're right though. You're right. We have to look for one. Uh -huh. After what he said, that two heads are better than, than one. one. Uh -huh. uh, but, Chai, I still feel I need to give her one more try. Let me try her one more time using Jordan style. I know. Uh, you want to try the using the cool now. Let me employ that system once again. Now you know now. <laughs> <laughs> Let me employ that tactic. Uh -huh. But where that feels, Anyway, but I still feel you making time. Anyhow, no, 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 Chaiki, I'd like to try. You see, that system has always worked for me. Let me try that one. It's not so bad, though. Let me try it. I don't know. Chaiki, I'm a witness. You don't, you don't cease to surprise me. I don't understand. So you mean all these native doctors think you're into it? Nah, no, I'm not. Chaiki! Come on, dear. Dear, dear, come on, Ali. You do some more time, bro. Oh, oh, oh. That's cool. Okay, okay, dear, dear. You don't want me to repeat myself. I am not interested. I am not interested. I've seen a million men like you, and I don't get moved by what they say. I understand how you feel, you know. Hmm? It is possible you must have seen a lot of men, and these men all have ulterior motives. I'm being frank with you. My motive is genuine. Do you know something? The very minute I set my eyes on you, I knew it immediately because God has always shown me this vision. 
Hmm. Alright, then I'll look back. I knew I was standing right in front of my wife. The more you talk, the more irritated I get. I just told you, I am not interested. Read my lips. Please, can you kindly get out of this place? Get out of this place or you want me to invite the police? No, 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 you don't need to get the police, okay? Listen, if we become friends, you will enjoy it. So this question of uh, gold digger, do I in any way look, look like a gold digger to you? I don't care whether you're a gold digger or a diamond digger, whatever. I am not interested. I don't want to get married anymore. Marriage is not in my agenda. Can you take your black ass and get out of this place? Excuse me, excuse me. Patricia, come to uh, yes, me. Come to me, Come to me, I said I'm not interested. I will consider your position. Hey, hey, man, when the mole never put for another man's mouth, mm. ah. if they hungry, too, ah, happy mouth, they bend it to swallow a bar. What's up? Hey, mm. listen, crayfish men are condition makers. But even self can fish like crayfish. Every dog they like to chop good. But give a meat, they go chop and clean out. You see, I have no doubt whatsoever about your powers. No. Because this man that brought me here is my best friend. And whatever is good for him is good for me. Alright? He will not see fire and ask me to put my hand inside at all. It's not possible. So I believe that he brought me to the home of solution. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm here. Mm -hmm. My child, it is okay. Change. I told you now, didn't I? You have to thank your friend that brought you here. He knows my what. What you seek, you shall find. So, my child. What can I do for you? Uh, Azu... Azu Anoka. It is very simple. You see... There is this girl... That I love... So very much. I love her too much. But she does not love me at all. At all. She doesn't even want to see me. Uh, so, what I want you to do is to make her love me more than I love her. No, I don't know that. Love passion. You know, in such a way, let her, she must love me in such a way that, one, she cannot stay without seeing me. Two, she must always dream about me at night when she's sleeping. Three, she must always think about me. Uh, but, uh, uh, nine, as, as one, please, I don't want her to die. Hey. <laughs> and also you want you want her money. Mm. My son. Consider it done. Chai! Asi kwa kwa kuru ya tu kwa reji 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 ya tu k
my parents at least for you to just see them and know what they look like that won't be a problem it's up to you anytime that pleases you the choice is yours not mine okay mm -hmm. see, but you don't need to ask me for such things all you need to do is tell me what you want and just consider it done most important thing is to see your parents and let them know what we are up to that's all all right um let's see Today is Tuesday, we could just... Friday. It's okay. Any day is okay, man. It's alright, so how are you doing today? Hey, look who's here. Melvin. Oh, yeah. I'm fine. Melvin, this is Frank, my friend, the guy I've been telling you about. Uh, Frank. My kid brother, Frank. <laughs> Melvin. Oh, good day. Okay, no thanks. Okay, good. Yeah, just see you outside for a little while. No, 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 excuse me. No, 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 you don't need to go outside. I'll, I'll run excuse you. No, no, no problems. I'll, let me just see you outside. I insist, okay? I insist. I'll excuse you, people, okay? Sweetheart. Okay. Right. Please, I'll excuse you, alright? Hmm? Oh. Okay. I'll meet you in your Yeah, hi. Um, Cynthia, I'd like you to see me this evening at my place, okay? Is anything the matter? Um, nothing much, but it's actually about, um, you know, this guy. Frank? Yes, Frank. You know, I've, you know, heard so much about the two of you, and seriously, he does strike me as a gold digger. You're wrong this time. For God's sake, he doesn't even know who that is. So how, why would you just say he's a gold digger? Cynthia, listen, you may not understand, okay? I'm your brother, okay? And I know one when I see one. And seriously, this man does strike me as a gold digger. Believe me. My spirit tells me so. Your spirit tells you so? Yes. I know that this guy is not a gold digger because I've tried him in so many ways. What is all this? For God's sake, look at me. I'm not getting any younger. Are you going to marry me? Would my dad marry me? Cynthia. Ah. Cynthia, I mean, why, why do you forget in no, such a hurry? Why? I mean, this was just the same way Mike came the other time and you believed him. Later, what happened? Huh? I mean, can't you just make use of your senses? All right. You remember yesterday so easily. So because Mike came and did whatever he did, I shouldn't trust anybody. 
I shouldn't get married. For God's sake, you're not going to marry me. It's okay. It's all right. Okay. Just kindly see me at my place this evening. Let's talk things over, okay? I'll try. This evening, huh? Alright. Even before I can open my mouth to ask her for lunch, she has already asked me. <laughs> and guess what? What? Do you know where she's asking us to go for lunch? Where? Sema restaurant. Ew. Oh boy. <laughs> well, I'm done blue. Ah, you're laughing. You're in trouble now. Push through. Ah, it's expensive now. <laughs> You see what I'm gonna tell you? She's the one fitting the bills. Eh? You know what I mean? Okay. Let me yeah. You know that? One will always have money in my pocket. Yeah. Insurance. Yeah, I know. After all, I told her I walk in the bank. Holy. <laughs> in that case, um, you know you're my friend. I will help you out with the little like I have. Check! Tango! You see, that's why I chose you as my friend. Hey, you know. In my next one, you will still be my friend. You will be my friend. So that we can continue the. My thoughts. Oh. Check! Yeah. By the time I finish with Ali, if she hears the name Frank, on her song, one woman. <laughs> I hear that we are now based in Japan. And uh, do you know since money is now coming my way, I've been thinking of where to be. Hey, yeah, okay. Is it to go to Germany or London? London or you? Just as like you see, these German people I don't like their life. Maybe, maybe, maybe. maybe one should just go to the moon. Uh -uh, no. Better still. On the <laughs> Six years of relocation <laughs> to either Germany or wherever, every moon, then I will invite you. <laughs> You're a very wicked man. Six years. <laughs> oh boy, go that level. <laughs> Look, I want to make effort like a man. Like a man. There's nothing like owning your own thing. Mm. Papa, let us talk. Let us talk. Bye bye to poverty. <laughs> <laughs> Do I really know what I'm doing? Wouldn't people laugh at me? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Man, the money's overwhelming. Let people say what they want. This is my own green card. Money and threats, everything. Guys, I'm so sorry. I hope I didn't waste so much of your time. Oh, not at all. I I knew something must have held you up. Hold on. Come on, see the kind of road up I ran into. It's too much. Okay. I'll quickly get the waiter so we can place your order. It's all right. Have you had something for yourself? Yeah, yes, I just had to have a Waiter! Waiter!
There is something I have been meaning to tell you since I set my eyes on you. Mm -hmm. And I think it's about time I told you about it. You see, Cynthia, I love you. <laughs> I love you so much. Cynthia. <laughs> Well, my fear is that I don't know if your father will allow an ordinary banker like me to marry his only daughter. I don't know. Frank, I should be telling you this. I have made up my mind and nobody can come between our marriage. Frank, I want you to know that I'm all yours. No. I feel honored. I'm so happy. Yeah, I'm very <laughs> pleased. This is the best thing I'm hearing all my life. Frankie, please don't do this to me now. Frankie. Frankie, please remember what we've gone through together. Frankie. Listen, listen, cousin. I am not interested in this summer of yours. This relationship is over. All right? Now just get out of my house. I don't want to see you again. Get out. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Please. Oh, my God. Please come to my rescue. What are you still waiting for here? You want to turn my house into a church? What is the matter now? Eh? Ah, but why, 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 you're not looking cheerful. What, what, what happened? Eh? Tell me, what, what's the matter? Frank. Frank, what, what did he do? Eh? I don't know what happened. What is it? What's going on? 
want to see me again. That he doesn't want to see you again. He wants to see me again. Oh. This, this, this Frank is a total fucker. Eh? Can't this guy ever grow up for once? Can't he grow up? Eh? What is wrong with this guy's health? Oh. Uh, Menji. I will see him. Oh. Please. Wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't, don't bother. I already you know. Have to I understand. I feel you. It's okay. I understand. I understand. I understand how you feel. Thank you, love God. I know. I know. Angie, you know what I would do? <laughs> eh? For you, I will tell you, come and see me next tomorrow. Hmm? I will talk sense into that boy because I know something is wrong with him. Please. Eh? Come and see me next tomorrow so that um, I will feed you with what I have discussed with him. Are you understanding me? Please Frank is so love, God. I please know, don't. I know. Are, are you telling me? Please you are the best for Frank now. You are. Look, I don't, that boy. I, in fact, I know something is wrong somewhere. I would definitely talk to him. Do you understand? He wake up from his sleep. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't take it easy. Eh? Take it easy. Eh? this place now. Tell me. This girl just showed up with her bad luck again. Tell me what would have happened if Cynthia had met her. Can you imagine? Is it not to knock my job? Can you imagine? Hey? So I sent her away. You better rearrange your wisdom now. Rearrange your wisdom and ask this girl to desist from coming to your house before she will rock your deal. In order for me, hmm? if Antonia eh, tries it with me, in this new cart, I am making every effort to get. But boy, I will kill him. Ah. Look, you better be very, very fast, smart about the whole matter. I hope this year's so-called wisdom is not foolishness. Check. Don't mind this man. Hey, but this you know what? If she steps into this house again, I will kill her. Kick her out! For what? Ah. Two of you. You can kill. Buy guns, kill people. But me? I'm going to Lagos. I am relocating to Lagos to live permanently. Major, I, I hope all is well. You hope all is well? Uh, yes. Study me. That's what I'm saying. Spirit, soul, and body. It's all well. I'm going to Lagos to look for my destiny. Major, you better watch it. Now that our deal has set, maturing, eh? matured already. Eh? Eh? You now want to go to Lagos. Okay. I don't come back and envy us. I will not give up because I won't give you anything. Back. I won't give Listen, you. you don't get this up. Tell him. Don't tell, him. Tell, him. tell him. This boy mind an 80 year old woman huh? just for green card to take this boy is. The, so the money is the money. Is so much money. Huh? And this deal we have on the ground right now. It's our own green card. If you like, go to Lagos. I just uh -uh. advised you. Franco, Chike, two of you can marry your grandmothers. For me, I'm not interested. I'm going to Lagos. Do me a favor. When you marry that to your grandmother, just teach her how to answer call. Because I'll be calling you from Lagos. Okay. Chike, okay. please open the door for him. Best of luck. Best of luck. Man. Man, do you know this guy is a fool? Can you imagine? You know sometimes he talks like somebody who senses his love. The guy is living in limbo. I mean, what do you expect? No problem, let him know. But I tell you what, I will not give him a time. Yeah, me, 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 she was crying when I saw her. Man, I thought you threw her out of this place. Yeah, you know, it was no better than saying that because it meant that I would have killed her here. Yeah, man, well, I think that would have been better so that I can go to become his.
Angel went to their house. I met him and uh, we really discussed. Save me that story. Just tell me what he actually said. Exactly what I'm trying to save you now. Um, in fact, from the look of things, it does appear that my guy is fed up with the relationship. Uh, just like that. What did he actually say? I don't know. In fact, the truth of the matter is that he said he does not want to continue with the relationship again. You know? But uh, let me tell you, Angie. Let me tell you, because I can see you're so engrossed in this whole relationship thing. Eh? Angie, look, if I were you, there is a way I will package myself. Eh? That's how I will, I will present myself and this guy will come running back to me. I'm telling you. Eh? Come on, look at yourself. If not someone, look at, look at skin. You are beautiful, elegant. Come on, Angie, you have what it takes to make an archbishop fall. Eh? Come on, but where was I gonna man? If the ungrateful element, eh? If the fool, let him let him go to hell. You understand? Okay, you don't understand. Understand what? It's everything. Frank is everything to me. Frank means everything to me. I can't see myself living with that friend. Can't you see that my whole world is crumbling before my very eyes? I am only trying to advise you. Eh? I am trying to advise you. And you are still telling me Frank is your this. Frank is your everything. Look, maybe you don't understand though. Where is my mirror? You don't understand how you are looking. You don't know, you don't appreciate the beauty that the Lord has given unto you. Angie, you have no, you don't, you don't seem to understand. Eh? Look at your skin. Look at your skin. This is called PF, presidential food, huh? or you can call it PP, presidential pattern. Eh? This is what you have, and you are just busy wasting your talent and gift on Frank, who does not even care for you. Come on, girl. Eh? Leave this human being alone and think of your future. Come on, understand. Okay. I have to tell this truth. Whatever that has to happen, let it happen. Angie, let me tell you. Frank's family, there is epilepsy running there. Oh ha. Nobody will do me anything. Let me tell you the truth. Let me tell you. That's why Frank has been doing all of the things he has been doing. Do you understand me? Frank's father died of epilepsy. Uh, but he told me his father is still alive. It's a lie. That's a bloody lie. Well, anyway, what do you expect him to tell you? He will tell you that something, one thing or the other has happened, but he will not tell you the gospel truth. But I am telling it to you now. The younger brother to the dad is roaming around the streets. He's mad. Look at Frank himself. Look at the way he's walking. Look at his shape. Something is wrong, bro. Do you understand? So let me tell you, the best thing now that it's an, it's an opportunity for you, bail yourself. God loves you. Just bail yourself. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Okay. Marriage is not by force. It's not by force. Uh, if the young man wants to marry you, he will. If he doesn't, go. if he doesn't, nobody will force him. Nothing, nothing. Nobody. He's cutting some grasses for the goats. Eh, uh, okay. Uh, Let me quickly get No, Frank! Uh, Papa Frank! Good afternoon. Son, your son is here. Good afternoon, man. Good afternoon, my dear. Uh, uh, <laughs> please, please, please. Oh, yeah. Sit down, eh? 
My dear, how is your husband and children? Hey, Papa. <laughs> you are welcome. You are welcome. Thank you, Baba. Thank you very much. Thank you, Baba. In fact, no wonder. Throughout the night, I did not sleep. I knew straight away that something was coming my way. Ah, Baba, you never change. Change to what? I'm being realistic. My son, how is the city? Baba, the city is very well. <laughs> and in fact, I don't need to ask about how you are feeling or faring because I see you are okay. <laughs> Frankie, this lady with you, is she dumb? No, no. I'm not dumb, sir. <laughs> It's just that, sir, I got carried away by your discussion. I'm sorry. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, my daughter. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Papa, uh, without wasting time, eh? you know your son, Frank, doesn't like wasting time at all. Mm. I want to go straight to the point. Yeah. The lady you see here, her name is Cynthia. Eh? You know you are mama. You've been bothering me since about this issue of settling down, settling down, settling down. So this is the lady I want to settle down with. Hmm. <laughs> you want to marry her or her daughter? Because if you want to marry anybody's daughter, that daughter must be bodily present here, not her mother. Mama, she's the one I want to marry. You are welcome. Thank you very much. You are welcome. Frankie. Yes, Baba. Can I see you for a moment? Thank you, boy. You so said this is the woman you want to marry. Are you out of your senses? Papa, or you are just joking? Papa, I don't understand what you mean. Huh? Oh, do you think you are getting any younger? That woman is old enough to be your mother. And I'm sure she has passed the age of menopause. Papa, look, I love her. I love her. You are in love with you. This Malu. This old Malu. Frank, do you want to bring shame to this family? Eh? Can't you see she's my age, if not my senior? When I saw you, people, I thought she just followed you to the village. I love her, I love her. Can you imagine that? Frank, God forbid. This is what you're saying, life is some kind of joke. Mama, you better stop it. You stop it. Look, huh? she's my choice. I made up my mind I'll marry her. And nobody, nobody will stop me from marrying her. Can you hear that? that? If I look at you, if I look at how old you are, and you want to go out there to bring in that expired woman, you don't understand. What have I got to understand? That you want to marry a woman of your mother's age? That is not enough for you to shout. Eh? Look, look at what time it is. The neighbors might think we're calling. Papa, listen. Papa, you see that lady? That lady is what? So many millions of men. Her father is so very rich. Papa, do you know that as soon as I marry that girl, our family will bid Permanent bye bye to poverty. Your dream of taking the Ozo title, eh? Guaranteed. You see, this is our small house. I will bring it down, level it up, and build a mansion here. Ah, Papa, look, look, look. You should know your son. Eh? You should know your son. After all, you named me Frank. And Frank means truth. Okay, Papa, maybe this will help you understand things better. Do you know a lot of people out there in the city are battling to travel abroad? Go there to secure green cards. Papa, do you know when they go out there, they do all sorts of things to secure this green card? But do you know your own son's green card? Your son's green card is this lady here. Alright? And then you know the strategy now. The strategy is, as soon as I marry her and the money comes out, I dump her and marry a small girl. Mm -hmm. I would have said. Ah. <laughs> but what is it? That's why I said you should trust your son. Yes. 
But there's something that is very, very important to you, and that is what I really want to sell to you. You know the Ibanku is coming up very soon. Yes. And as a man, I'm expected to make certain contributions so that it would not look as if the girl's family is sponsoring the entire wedding. Yes. I have to have some money with me. You know. So I'm thinking, is it that your land? That land, the one by the riverside. I'm thinking you should sell it and give me the money. You know, so I can use the money for the wedding. And then once the wedding is come and gone, then the money will come out. Then I will buy you the choicest land in any part of the village you choose. If you want two, if you want five, ten, I'll buy for you. Well, as long as it works well. It has already worked out. It is said that everything worked for good. Yeah. Eh? For those who love God, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, in that case, I don't have any problem. The land can go. <laughs> Papa, I trust you. Papa. If you know what I suffered before I cornered that girl, the race was hot. A lot of men were chasing this girl, going after her. But trust your son. <laughs> eh? I conquered. <laughs> My boy, I asked that you see me. May I know your name? My name is Frank Okeke. Okay, okay. I'm from Afro village in Imo State. Who is your father and what does he do? My father's name is um, Chief Cyprian Okeke. Okay, okay. He's a businessman, sir. I see. Now tell me something. Why do you want to marry my daughter? I mean, of all the people in this world, why my daughter? Why? So, so I, 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 I was... I think that question is necessary. Is it? What are all these questions for? There's no problem. I think that is right. You know, as a father, I think it's necessary for him to get to know certain things about um, his would-be son-in-law. So I think it's in order. Uh, sir, I, from my heart, sir, I love your daughter. I love her very much. Mm. <laughs> and uh, I also know that she's level-headed. Mm. Yeah. Taking from the kind of family she comes from, yeah. you know, and uh, I believe that um, if we get married, that we're going to live happily. Mm. And but sir, that is not basically why I'm here. I came to pick an official date that I can come with my people to see you properly. This is great. Well. I heard you, but I need some time to think about it. Okay. Think about what? Must we kill the boy because he came to marry our daughter? Okay, when you came to marry me, did my parents give you these conditions? Dad, why are you doing this to me? Why are you walking out? That's because your parents were nobodies and they needed me to lift them up from their squalor and That's poverty. Not true. Okay. I don't know why my dad is behaving this way. I don't know myself. See, I love Frank and Frank loves me too. I can see that. Anything, if I have in any way offended your husband, please help me beg him. Yes. 
You have not, Frank. Okay, sweetheart. Oh, oh my God, it's Frank. Oh my God, oh, stop it. Oh God. Oh, oh my God. Don't cry. This is pure Lord. Oh my God, he's crying. Oh no. I will talk to him. I will see what I can do. Okay. I will die with no, 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 no. Oh my God, I get love up, you too, up, Frankie. Oh, Frankie, darling, no, oh, stop crying. Oh, baby boy, stop crying. Oh, stop crying, boy. <laughs> Thank Please. What am I eating that I may have done to you? Please forgive me. <laughs> Just find a place in your heart to forgive me, because no child. You must be out of your senses. Look, let me tell you. Antonia, there is nothing you will say here. There is nothing you will do here that will make me change my mind. Are you hearing me? I am done with you. I don't want you in my house again. Leave my house. Jay, don't do this to me because remember the past. Go, be, 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 go, don't even go to the past because there is no past. The past has been so characterized with economic hardship. Don't even bother going there, please. Uh, don't. Don't let people laugh at me, please. Eh? And so what? That's what I mean. What about me? Eh? What about me? Antonia. Ever since I started dating you, ever since I started going out with you for Christ's sake, nothing good has ever come my way. I go to the north, bad luck. To the south, bad luck. Bad luck everywhere. And you want me to continue with this relationship? Oh, what, what, man, lady? Ah, for what? Please, 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 leave my house. Ah, just look at yourself now. Look around you. Take a look. Look eh? at all the mates, all my mates. The people I started with, they've all made it. They made it. I am here, just the same old person, managing to feed every time. Look at my stereo. I've not been able to replace it. And you are telling me what? Because at least, please, 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 just leave the house. There. So this is what has been on your mind all this while. Eh? So this is what you have been thinking. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, let me remind you that I'm not God. Neither am I God. And no one is God. That's what we are saying the same thing. Jane, I know what you want to do. But it will not work for you. Because the God I serve is not asleep. He will eventually deal with you, Jay. I wish you the he same. Will Regret or no regret, that's not even the issue. The issue is that you should leave me alone. You don't even understand the magnitude of cause that, that you have placed on me. As soon as you leave here now, I am going for deliverance. My Bible is radio, if you don't know. You don't know what the prophets told me. now. May God bless you, man. I don't stay in the house. Yeah. Normally, you should not stop you from asking them to clean uh, the pool. Yes, yes. he says so. Supposing I need a dip now, how do I do it? Thank you very much. 
Uh, please, I'm asking after Cynthia. Oh, Cynthia. I guess she's in the living room. Okay. I'll quickly go and see her. Okay, my dear. If you'll excuse me. Eh? You're welcome. Excuse me, Chief. Will you just keep quiet and stop all this stupid talk about love, 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 love? Can't you read between the lines? You see my daddy? Okay. Hi, daddy. Good afternoon, Mommy. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Here we go. Sit down. I'll show you what's the best. What's the Yes. Let me see. Okay. Yes. I knew you were going to come. Yes, yeah, no. Yeah. Oh, baby. <laughs> Frankie boy. I got you a beautiful card. Oh, God. You got me a card. Oh, no. This is beautiful. I found my happiness in you. Oh, Frankie. <laughs> I have not been very comfortable with this boy. Why? Honestly. Why, honey? Ever since he came to us, I've always seen him as a man who is not genuine. No. Yes, and I think he's using our daughter as a bait to get to us. That is it. I like vanilla. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> How does it taste? <laughs> <laughs> This boy is a gold digger. He's prospecting for gold in our house. Sweetheart. That's what he's doing. I am looking at this boy. What I am seeing is that the boy is in love with our ah, daughter. What, 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 what? Can't what you love? see? Can't you see it? This is what I call pure and unadulterated kind of you love. Keep quiet. Look at your parents. At their age, they're so happily in love with each other. Yeah, that's what we're going to be too. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me believe that you're jealous. Jealous of what? Of my own daughter? What are you talking about? I think the problem is that you are myopic. You cannot see beyond your nose. You see, what I see sitting on the ground, you cannot see sitting at top of the highest Iroko tree. I am watching them. And I'm watching this boy. Yes, I am watching him. And I hope you are watching too. Because you'll be shocked when it turns out to be what he is. Yes. Please call me Carlo. I want to know why they have refused to clean this pool. I want to know why they refuse to clean the compound. Because I paid them enough money to do their work. Carlo! Carlo! My problem is my husband. Hmm? Yes. He believes that that young man is a mercenary, a gold digger. <laughs> my sister, look at you. Hmm? So you people just want your daughter to lose the opportunity God has given her. Hmm? Listen, let me tell you. You and your husband should be thankful to God that somebody has agreed to marry your daughter. Don't misunderstand me, yo. Eh? My sister, what I've been told, can't you see that age is no more on her side? Hmm? Before you know it, she will pass the age of menopause. And you know what that means. Look, I'm surprised you know that you. I'm surprised that you, Ebele. Oh, have you come to insult me in my own home? I thought yeah. we were friends. We are friends, of course. We are friends. So why why are you? That is why like I'm telling you the truth. 
Let us assume that the boy is a gold digger. Hmm? Then you and your husband will put heads together and make him somebody. Get if you are a What both parties need here is commitments. That's all. You're getting me confused. You confused me. My dear, you know that truth is bitter. But it has to be told. You need that boy. And that boy needs you. Eh? That's one apart. But listen here. I thought we are supposed to be discussing on how gorgeously dressed we are going to look on that day. Eh? Because as for me, I will be in my Sunday best. Likewise, other women. And the day to the wedding day, I will stop eating. Bam, bam. So that there will be enough space in my stomach. Mm -hmm. I'm amazed at what you're saying. Amazed? Yes, amazed. My dear, you don't have to. You don't have to be amazed. Because I believe in the truth. Hmm? Smile. Something good is coming your way. Eh? You're supposed to be happy. to bring it to your notice. Mm, really? Yeah. I hope it's not about Frank. Well, um, I have always wanted Dad! To... Dad! You have confronted me with this issue before now. For God's sake, not once, not twice. Likewise, Melvin. This guy is not a gold digger. He doesn't even know you are rich. We should be praying that the, the parents are, are allowing him to marry me. We are your parents, and we desire the best for you. Mm. But yeah, that man is not good enough for you. Yes. He is a gold digger. I had enough of this. Enough of this, for God's sake. There are so many people out there that's been living without money. I love Frank, and Frank loves me. And my love is not a gold digger. Is everything in life all about money? There are so many people out there that do not have money, yet they are okay. Dad, for God's sake, let's just give him a chance. Can you live without money? You promise that the way you love Frank, you can live without money. Listen, my dear. This talk is not about money. My problem is that I love you as my daughter. I see beyond your vision and I want the best for you. Oh, I will sleep. That is if I can sleep too. I don't want to hurt you. Neither do I want to hurt you, Daddy. All that matters right now is how I feel about Frank. I love you. <laughs> we, love you. we love you too. We love you very much. We want I the best know, for you. Okay? I know. I love Frank and I want to marry him. Listen, forget that guy, okay? You see, he's nothing but a gold digger. Alright? See. See, that man thinks he's smart, but you know something? 
He doesn't know he's meddling with the wrong guy. Melvin, I... I don't understand where you're going to. I mean, what listen, I get... Listen, Ken, listen. This man is after nothing but my family's wealth. Yes. But you know what? He's getting nothing, okay? He's getting nowhere. Trust me. My dear Melvin, I think... Um, I think you should be throwing parties all over town by now. Parties? Yes. <laughs> you know, I think you should be throwing, throwing parties because of what is about to happen. Mm -hmm. No, no, tell me, um, why should I be throwing parties? Well, let me ask you a question. Right? If you were in that man's shoes, would you marry her? I mean, let's be realistic with each other, okay? One on one. Would you? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, well, God's sake. I'm just trying to be factual with you. Melvin. Look at it this way. Let's take your sister's example. Now take a look at your sis, you know. I mean, <laughs> you know, there's nothing else there. The only attraction there is the, the money. <laughs> you know. Look, that man deserves a serious pat on the back. Now I know I don't have a friend in you. No, Melvin, you're getting it all wrong. You can never get a better friend than myself. I can't get out of my house. What? I said get out now. Get out! Now come on, you can't possibly be serious. See, I've never been more serious in my life. I said get out! Melvin, I said get out. Stand up and leave! Out! Okay. No problem. I'll leave. I'll leave, Belvin. But let me tell you one thing. No one else can tell you the truth except me. Get out. Okay. No problem. I'll leave. Okay, Melvin. I'll be seeing you around, man. <laughs> well, you see, I actually did want to see you because I uh, checked this issue all around and weighed it the way I should. And really, I've come to the conclusion that this um, friend doesn't have genuine love for you. Yes, I mean, come on, come on. I mean, how many times would you be deceived? Huh? Have you forgotten in the hurry how they all came in the past? Remember Chooks? Tony? Mike? Oh, come on, Cynthia, come on, use your head for God's sake. I'm so shocked the way you're sounding. What else on earth do you want this guy to do to prove that he loves me? Do you know from his meager resources he gives me money? Oh, he has to kill himself for you to believe that, right? My father is saying this and you too. You know, Cynthia, you amaze me, seriously. See, you act as if you don't know people. You see, this man is ready to do away with everything he has just to get what he's pursuing. Yes. So you see, what he's doing right now, I'm not interested in. So keep that on the sidelines, okay? Because what I'm really interested in is what's in his mind, you know, his motive. That's what. No, take a good look. Of 
something. There's this adage that says women are like rose flowers. In the morning they blossom. And at noon they are gone. Melvin, I'm going. I'm going. Stop. Stop. Stop this. Stop this. I can't stand you. It's okay. I'll, I'll come. I'll come see Dad later. Okay. It's all right. It's okay. <laughs> We have been here for the past two hours, sitting here for the past two hours, and we have not achieved anything. <clears throat> Frank, I have one or two things to contribute concerning this matter. That woman you are about to marry is too old for you. And you don't have to blame your mother for bringing us into this matter. Tell him all. She Thank desires you. good for you. I hear you. Let me ask you one question. All this while that I've been suffering in the city, where were you? Did you ask after me? Did you care about me? Oh, because you now know that I'm about to hit it big. God is about to usher me into an era of wealth you have now come to pose a stumbling block on my way i know you you're an enemy of progress enemy of progress because if i had listened to your advice way back i wouldn't have succeeded today let me ask you is it my mother that is marrying the woman or me? Is it my mother? Huh? Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me even ask. What is this gathering supposed to mean? Oh, you people want to prove to my mother that you love her more than I do? Lie. This is jealousy. This is envy. If you don't know, let me tell you. Whatever affects me positively affects my mother too. Because you people also know that when this money arrives, I am going to be cruising in my Jeep. And while I'm cruising in my Jeep, I will buy a car for my mother. Alright? Employ a driver that will be driving. Hey, hey, hey. Count me out. Count me out, please. No sane man will do what you are doing. And nobody cares. Even if you are to cruise in an aeroplane. Forget yourself. Poverty will kill you. The most important thing is that we have to look into this matter, period. If I may come in, this matter is not supposed to be treated by us. We are many his mother's people. For my own opinion, though, this is purely a domestic matter and should be treated as such. Especially when it, when it involves an adult like this. I think what he said is right. Frank, a word of advice. That woman you want to marry is too old for you. Money is not everything. We have heard about the money and uh, the motto that we follow suit upon marriage. Jealousy, I said it, confirmed. Confirm jealousy. You have heard, but that is small. More will come. And then if you want to die, you will die, die. So keep this advice. Save this advice for yourself. Advise yourself. You want to preach my mother against me. That's what you want to do. But you failed again. You have failed. I think it is this red cap you're wearing. I don't know who gave it to you that is deceiving you. But let me tell you. Once this money arrives, I will use that money to remove that car from your head. Impossible. Uh, gentlemen, I think this meeting is over. So, let us rise and pray. I am not, I'm not praying. I am not praying. Uh, how will you? I know a few days ago. Franklin. Uh, okay. Franklin. Look! I see wait! Look 
girl, they call you wait. No girl. Franklin. I support whatever action you want to take. Don't mind these people. Oh. After all, the young girl that's saying is too old. Did they know her age? Wait, okay, the what are you talking about? Okay, the what are you talking about? Okay, the what are you talking about? What I'm saying is that where you are going is the very place in Pew Pew. That envy you because you will soon be hitting gold mine. Where are you getting all this information from? Oh. Is it because we are in this village? You people feel we are daft? Yeah? When the day of my choice, don't forget me. Oh. But, meanwhile, anything for the boys. He bought it for me as a gift after our first baby birth. You don't say. <gasps> this is too cool. Hey, thank God. I know God is not asleep. Hey. I am so happy for you. Uh, uh, my sister, mm. what about you? What are you people still waiting for? My throat is getting dried. <laughs> oh, my daughter. No, don't worry. When next I visit, I'll get you the invitation card, okay? You know all these importers, they hardly have time for themselves. But we finally chose it. It's damn good at last. What about those two rascals? Chike and... Um, don't mind uh, them. They are still busy chasing after old women, eh? Looking for whom to defraud. But they will eventually meet their Waterloo. Amen. Ah. Amen. So my sister, where are you off to? Just somewhere very close to that place. Uh. I'm hoping now, let me give you a ride. Oh, thank you. At least let me follow you and enjoy this, you're right. Oh this is God. too wonderful. Oh, oh, oh. You can't beat it. The whole thing is gradually maturing. Your man now feels like a dog. Hey, hmm? Like a big dog. It's your mm -hmm. So I can start calling you Don Franco. Don Franco. <laughs> Don Franco. That's all. <laughs> yeah. Give me the lowdown. Do you know that? When we are through with the wedding, yeah. Everything will take shape. Shape. Then we begin to. But you know something? Yeah. But you know what almost spoils the whole thing, man? What, 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 what I went to the village, man. Can you imagine? Those old parents of mine, man. Shit. What happened? 
Hey, they almost knocked my jaw. But you know me. Uh, block on it. I just skimmed. I trust you now. Uh, the bad schemer. Mm -hmm. I just skimmed it. I feel you. Eh? I just know. What are Wonderful you talking? schemer. <laughs> Don't you skim in one Don skim. Franco. Don Franco. What of me? Ah. Hmm? What happened? Look, the way it is right now, your brother don't even mind. Even if the girl is epileptic. 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 Mm. Or even mm. blind. Oh, but I don't mind. So long, so as, long as, as the boy is good. I can feel it. Enough. The boy is good. He's blowing. Mm. You, you know what I'm saying? That's what I don't know about what. <laughs> <laughs> I trust you. I'm telling you. But let me surprise you. What? Don't scream. What is it? Say, take Uncle. a look at this. Franco, this is a wedding card. Just take a look at this. Franco, don't, don't tell me you have printed wedding card. Uh, don't tell me. Don Franco. Oh. <laughs> the wedding card said, oh. What are you not talking? Ah. I didn't trust your man again. You <laughs> you know, <laughs> Who designed it for you? Multi printers. Hey, the biggest printers in town. No, we go. Our money. Hey. Oh, oh, our money. <laughs> I feel you. I feel you. <laughs> oh, God damn. You could just like, have a problem. Nah, what problem? You know, sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down. It's a very serious matter. What problem? You know, the money I realized from the sale of that land yes. has exhausted. Man. And you know, the way things are right now, I need some money to let it seem as if you know I am, you know I'm doing things, you know, let not look as if I let everything to my in-laws to do. If you do my in-laws, they've promised to take care of the drinks. I understand. You know those basic things in marriage, yeah. in wedding, yeah. that a man ought to take care of. Those are the things I'm looking for money to take care of. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm looking at, uh, say, about. Anywhere I can get about, say, 200,000 now. Yeah. Even if it means borrowing it, I don't mind. Frank, I got one. So, how do you want to go about it? I know you don't have money, but you might have an idea. Anyway, there is this man I know, but you have to pay interest. Chaiko, is this what you're talking gently? No, now, you don't talk things like that. Look, I don't mind. You don't mind? Well, you know now that immediately the wedding is too. The game is set. You know. Alright? Mm. Money will soon will start rolling in. Mm. Rolling in. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I know, I know. You know, you first of all sow. And then you water. And then, and then you reap. Rip. Franco, <laughs> <laughs> whatever interest. We will pay. You know. We will pay. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Yes, sir. Uh, Consider it done then. Yes, no problem. Hmm? Consider it done. I will talk to him and you get the money. Wow. Hmm? Meanwhile, Don Franco. There is good news. Good news? I am telling you. Break it down. Yeah. You know, you didn't say there is a good name. I'm saying break it. <laughs> there is this girl. They directed me to go and see. Hmm? Yes. She is cripple. Uh-huh. Cripple. <laughs> oh, but you know, it's okay. The boy is good. Is there? Ah, 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 even if it's are you single? Even if it's look hunchback, I don't mind. Test me, I don't know about what. We are in this game together. What are you? I, you, you want to make the money and then I will be there. No, 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 no. I'm waiting for you. Come here, Lord. That's what I'm saying. I have to. <laughs> so, boy, that's where I am going. You see, as I'm. Uh, let me have my card. Oh yes, you can have your card. Yes, sir. Well, that's where I'm going right now. Yeah. So if you don't mind, we can start going. It was good. Oh, you here now. Ah, where? This is not do not
Neither have I come here to talk about dating. Ology, I have come here to ask your hand in marriage. <laughs> oh my God! Please, sorry, sorry, my dear, sorry. <laughs> See, not like I'm laughing at you. Yeah, I understand. Because you're happy a uh, husband has come. <laughs> My wedding card. It's coming up next Saturday. And I hope you'll be there. Yeah, excuse me. Yeah? Good. Oh. Mr. Man, what's happening here? Sexy! 